Wait, who wanted it with the king? Biggie takes every word from an MC and he flips it. So if he used the, if you use the word and you think it's his word, he going to use it. He going to use your word on you. I'm going to give you a I'm going to give you a uh, I'm going to give you a Jay-Z diss real quick. The Jay-Z diss. A gay D diss. J big. Is this Jake? Yo, it's is yeah. All that he comes at, he comes at everybody. I'm going to give you the line that Jay says. When I was pushing weight back in 88, you was a ballerina, nigga. I seen you. And he say, he say, nigga, I'm still getting money from 88. What? Conscience of your nonsense, Big said. I'm conscious of your nonsense. In 88, so more powder than Johnson and Johnson. He fucks with you. Far as, as matching the words. He fucks with you. These are shots. These are shots. I know another fun fact. When 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 on the beginning of kicking the door, when he begins to say, I got four albums, son, and fuck that. Who are you to be talking telling me? I knew that that was a woo. It more at first more sounded like meth, but I'm like, meth is cool with the nigga, but the style, I couldn't ever get the style. And when I couldn't get the style, now I realize that it's Ghostface. That's Ghostface. Because he's still... But the angry, what they call mad rapper? Yeah, yeah, but the four albums and the fuck that, who is you? He's still poking at Ghostface. The whole shit is is a, is a uh, is a is a roasting session, but let me keep going. Let me keep going, and I'm gonna get to the roasting session. He gets into it with OGC. It was posted that he had cl- he had stole a hook from over there. OGC is the original gun clappers. For those that don't know, gotta be deep in this hip hop to know that. It was a top dog idea. The the verse was the 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 riff was the cool as the best of them, but as bad as the worst. But that's really a Bob Marley groove. But they were using it, and they used it first, and then Big knew this, and they they had war with Big, and then Big comes out with the fucking groove, and they had problems. It's alleged that that that, that Health the Skelter even got jumped by Junior Mafia over this shit. The shit had boiled over. But it was just a fight. So Big had also had beef with them in that camp. Which is also really a Tupac camp. Because you know, you know Black Moon and all them niggas and Weston, they all they all really Pac fans. I mean, you know, Pac people, but, you know, they fuck with Big. There's a couple of them with Big. But Big, but this is leading up to, again, with beef with J. Rue the Damager, as far as that one day joint. Now, I thought this, I thought, you know, uh, at that time, in that period, that he was anti-Biggie. He was anti-Puff. Because this is the time where Bad Boy and their, and their, and their, their image is just starting to be noticed. And how they do, and, and he was coming out. You know, hip hop is in trouble. Meet me at my spot on the double. You know what I'm saying? That's what I thought he was. That was what he was doing. But he's saying, you know, Biggie Smalls is my man, and I know him. And it wasn't really about him. It was really about just Puffy individually. You know, but Big Big felt some type of way. He said, but you said Big said, but nigga, you said he got a Versace suit on. Nigga, you talking about me? You know what I'm saying? And these was the niggas. And and, 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 and who's the producer for J. Rue the Damager? Could you help me out? Uh, Premier. DJ Premier. DJ Premier. Give it up for this nigga. So this is where he say, and, and, and kick, the, uh, kick down the door, uh, kick in the door, when he say, son, I'm surprised you run with them. He's dissing Premier. Because he, he, he thinks Premier is too dope to be with these niggas. 